You are watching Dr. Walls and Friends. Welcome back to Dr. Walls and Friends on Opulence TV and we are here today with Herman Davis of the Peace and Love Foundation and we're talking about our upcoming event on October 18th in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania in the healing process. The healing process. And we will be raising awareness about domestic violence and the domino effect of domestic violence. And so as we collaborated Peace and Love, Dr. Walls and Friends, as well as Sisters in Harmony. And we started talking about how do we need to do this. And so we opted to do three panel discussions mm -hmm. that day. And so would you tell the people about the panel discussions that we're going to have? I'm not as good as you. Yeah. I everything, but one panel discussion <laughs> that I do remember is the panel discussion with the um, three religious backgrounds. Yes. With the Imam from the Muslim community. Mm -hmm. Um, with a pastor from the Christian community yes. and with a rabbi from the Jewish community. Yes. Um, because unfortunately, domestic violence is in all of those communities mm -hmm. and unfortunately, to speak of it is like a taboo mm -hmm. conversation. Um, and I know of it personally in the Muslim community because of the work that I do. Yes. People think that I um, am the one to call when they're in a domestic violence situation but I can only direct them to the um, powers that they can help them yeah which I, I which I really am um, on my bucket list is to go back to school mm -hmm. for family and children therapy whereas so I can help them yes. when they give that phone call um, but you know it's 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 um it's like a good feeling to feel like they think that much of me to call mm -hmm. me but at the exact same time it's a horrible feeling mm -hmm. because I, I, I can't help them and I don't want to say the wrong thing right. and send them the wrong way right. or to send them the other. I just don't know what to say so I mm -hmm. try to keep it sweet and short and get off the phone. So yeah, I'll connect you. Yup, just because I don't want to, I don't, you know, you just don't know, you know, it's, it's, it's like it's Pandora's box, you don't know. Yeah. The smallest thing can, can, can start a, you know, can start something. It can trigger. Yeah. And, and that's so important. And that's why we're doing so many panel discussions. So we'll definitely have the panel discussion where we'll actually have people who have been victims Correct. of domestic violence. Correct. Male abusers and female victims. Yep. Correct? Correct. And so, and one of the panelists, or rather two of the panelists are very interesting because they've had a history of having a domestic violent relationship mm -hmm. went through the healing process mm -hmm. and are now still together yeah they actually do separated divorced mm -hmm. and they're back together yes so that's going to be a very interesting discussion yeah yeah and it is a lot of people should hear because a lot of times people will stay in situations but they don't do the healing work and they wonder why is this not working and right. it's because they haven't done the work that needs to occur. Correct. But in this situation, as you said, they divorced, they did the work, and then they were able to come back Correct. together. So we'll have that panel discussion. We'll also have the panel discussion of the healers and the ministers. And so it's going to be a very rich yeah. day yeah. that day. And we'll also have the healing components of poetry mm -hmm. and music. Mm -hmm. And now why did you feel as though that was important to incorporate throughout the day? Um, because it's therapeutic. Mm -hmm. You know, art, um, you know, peace and love, we are, are big believers that art is a form of therapy. Yes. You know, whether it's journaling, whether it's poetry, whether it's rapping, whether it's painting, mm -hmm. whether it's playing an instrument, whether it's dancing, it's mm -hmm. all therapeutic. Yes. It's all therapeutic. So to add that in it, um, uh, you know, we thought it was a good idea to add to it. Yeah. Sprinkle it in there some kind exactly. of way. Exactly. Yeah. And also a good way to break the day up. Correct. Because the conversations that we're going to be having can be very heavy. Mm -hmm. And so it's important to have, again, that healing aspect come in for Correct. a reprieve mm -hmm. for those who are listening. Because we can be traumatized by association. Mm -hmm by hearing some of these stories. Mm -hmm. And so when we talk about domestic violence and we talk about the domino effect of it, it's so important because although you may not be in it, you are affected yeah. by it. Correct. Neighbors, coworkers, classmates, Correct. your children, schoolmates, you, everyone, this is a community impact mm -hmm. that happens. Mm -hmm. 
even the people next door that that's witnessing it by yes. you're hearing about it yeah they're affected by it you better believe it they're affected by it yeah i know the other night it was four o'clock in the morning and i heard somebody outside yelling where is that b let me at her and mm. was being instigated by somebody else mm. and she better come out and i'm looking at the clock going it is five not even five o'clock in the morning and i'm holding my phone getting ready to dial 911 no because I'm going, I will not be a silent participant mm -hmm. in this going. Yeah. It took, it took, it took some time for the neighbors of my sister, my sister's neighbor before they stepped up and made wow. a statement. Yeah, it, it didn't happen, it didn't happen right away. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I think one of the things that we have to understand as a neighborhood, as a community, and as a global community, is that we all play a part in the healing. All play a part. Because we all play a part in the hurting. That's right. Yeah, we all play a part. That's Absolutely. right. So now for people to find out more about Peace and Love, where's the best place for them to go? On the website is um, www.weneedpeaceandlove.org. www.weneedpeaceandlove.org. Is that really easy to remember? Yes, it is. Yeah. Yes, we need peace and love. And we I love that affirmation, love. putting that constantly out into the universe. Mm -hmm. We need peace and love. We need it. All right. Immediately. Yes. <laughs> and is there a Facebook page? Um, my Facebook page, I don't have, well, we do have, well, uh, we have the Peace and Love AUC page. Yes. Um, but my page, Herman Davis Facebook page, is, is all about peace and love. Mm -hmm. And I, I use it on purpose for my name because I'm, you know, people look for it. They won't look for peace and love. They'll look for Herman. Yes. Quicker than look for peace and love. Yes. So I have over 4,000 friends. And if you, you follow me on Facebook, you'll see all I do is talk about is peace and love. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's all I talk about. And it's also wonderful because there's also shirts that you can buy. And there's buy. also shirts. Yeah, the goal is, so here's what, here's what maybe we um, neglected to talk about is that October is Domestic Violence Month. Yes. Um, unfortunately, the um, breast cancer um, overshadows, you know, it, it takes a big hold that month because you have a lot of survivors from breast cancer, yes. but what people fail to realize is that you have survivors from breast cancer that has been dealing with domestic violence. That's right. Um, but yeah, the goal is to have everybody come out and purchase and wear their uh, peace and love shirt. Yes. Um, gray or white with a purple logo That's or right. purple shirt with a purple logo. Yes. Um, because purple is the color for domestic violence. Yes. Um, and again, the whole branding and marketing piece of mm -hmm. that, you know, it, it, it would it would it would it would do something to me to walk into a room and everybody has their own purple piece of love shirt. All right, so that's a call to action, people. We got to get your tambourine. That's right. We got to get the tambourine. <laughs> but I'm calling people to action to get their peace and love shirt, their purple shirt with Correct. the purple logo, Correct. or the gray shirt with the purple peace and love logo. And where can people go to buy these shirts? They can they can they can find me on on Facebook at um, Herman Davis on Facebook or they can call me at 267-973-2375 or they can log on to the website um, www.weneedpeaceandlove.org and they can inbox a message on there also. Give them the phone number one more time. That phone number is 267-973-2375. And what I'll do is also I will get a link and I will add it to my AskDrWalls.com page awesome. and that way they can go and click on that and get to you as well. Awesome. And so, and just to highlight before we close this beautiful picture behind us. I which love is this. From I love Omoja this. Communications and it's Sisters in Harmony, She Is Me. And so we chose this picture because of the immediate connection as we're talking about she is me. Mm -hmm. So our sisters who are in these domestic violence situations, it could be me. It could be my female cousin. It could be my, you know, my female neighbor. She is me. What is happening to her is happening to me. And we have to remember mm -hmm. the connection between us. Mm -hmm. And so as they say, treat people like you want to be treated. I don't want this to happen to me, mm -hmm. and I make sure that it doesn't happen to me. I also don't want this to happen to any of my sisters. Awesome. I and, love this piece. Yeah. So we're going to get 
Brother Ed Umoja Herman, who created this piece, we're going to have him come on a little later to talk about this piece and what made him design it. Nice. Right. Imagine that, an event with two Hermans at the exact same time. What does that mean? I just bet you hold on. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> hold on. All right now. <laughs> Well, thank you so much for joining oh, us today you. on Dr. Walls and Friends. And as always, thank you for doing what you do. Awesome. Thank you. All right. And we'll see you again on Dr. Walls and Friends.